Now, usually I just uh, film myself hoarding weird, quirky and obsolete tech stuff. But uh, once in a while, I genuinely try to give uh, competent and uh, relevant uh, consumer advice. Case in point, this Parkside uh, laser level called the PKLL10B3 model. Now, I purchased this, uh, this gadget for about 30 euros, more specifically 150 lei, and that is actually 30 to 32 euros, depending on the exchange rate. And it comes with a three-year warranty and also a tripod stand, which is rather important for me. You see... I'm in the middle of uh, refurbishing an old house. This is a kind of a DIY side project. I'm not going to be doing it all by myself, but I like to consider myself the project manager to this endeavor. Therefore, I need proper tools, which includes a, level, uh, a laser level thingy. So, without any further ado, let's do a proper unboxing and see what this thing is all about. In the meantime, I shall be explaining to you what I'm trying to do with this thing uh, and uh, why I purchased it. Now, normally a professional laser level uh, tool is somewhere north of 200 euros, which is more than I can afford for this DIY project. This is the bill of sale, uh, by the way, which I need to keep since I have a three-year warranty. I'll make sure to keep that in the box and the box itself for a while before I decide to discard it. So, getting back to the story, uh, since a professional level uh, laser uh, thingy costs more than 200 euros, uh, I figured I, would, I will just buy the bullet and buy this one from Lidl. By the way, I have batteries, actually rechargeable ones, which I will be using uh, just in a bit, but let's get on with the unboxing. So what I'm most curious about is the tripod, because if it's not usable for this laser, uh, um, laser gadget, then I can just use it for my cameras. By the way, nice surprise. Here are, a, well, there should be a couple. Just one battery. Ah, so somebody stole the other battery because this, uh, this laser tool was previously uh, opened. But no matter. Um, I have rechargeable units, um, so that's not a problem. Let me just go and get them. Okay, so I have also adjusted the camera a bit so you can see more of this tripod, which actually is in, it has an excellent, excellent build quality to it. I know it's not professional grade, but really it's not flimsy at all. It hardly flexes and this well, this center piece, this alignment here in the middle is much better than, uh, I would suppose, than my uh, big camera tripod. Though that could be an illusion since that one is more than uh, 160 centimeters. Might as well be more flimsy since there's more space between the alignments. Anyway, back to the gadget at hand. Here is the park side laser level now um i don't know how to review this these types of uh, uh these types of uh tools so i will just say this i'm interested in the build quality and whether this can be used during daylight and if it's easy to use these are my top three well my main three criteria I might be getting some conclusions later on throughout the video and I shall be sharing them as I go along. So let me just place in the rechargeable batteries which I got separately on a different occasion and turn on this 
laser level. And it seems to be working though <laughs> hardly anything can be shown in uh, this light. So let me just set it down on something. I'll use this prop for it and see if it works. By the way, it has two buttons for, uh, called V and H and I presume that's for vertical and horizontal leveling. So there it goes. Actually, well, you can see that uh, it shows during light. Uh, so I'm kind of intrigued and pleased by this thing. Uh, seeing as it really works for 150 lei or 30 euros thereabouts it's a great bargain I mean what could you want more also it has this tripod which is always a bonus I would have purchased this gadget alone without the tripod also worth pointing out that even though this tripod is uh, of a rather limited dimension, sort of 60 centimeters of or thereabouts, about one foot and change, uh, the mounting point is a synonym to what you would find in a camera mounting point or in a camera specific tripod. Therefore, uh, you could purchase any camera video or photography uh, tripod and use it along with this laser which is a great uh, addition. Suffice it to say I'm very pleased with that, how this thing works and well given the price and the three year warranty what else can I say other than uh, it's also very well built. Um, so yeah, if you want a laser level just for the fun of it, maybe it doesn't have to be a professional tool. Uh, you just want to, you know, to familiarize yourself with your surroundings and your landscape to your property or whatever. Uh, for 30 euros, this is a great, great tool. So pop in the comment section, let me know. Are you a professional builder? Do you own a device like this? Do you own a professional great device like this? Would you recommend this? Would you uh, recommend people to avoid buying this? All these are questions I would like to uh, get some answers to since I have also um, a subjective um, interest in this gadget so I don't know if this made any sense or not but this was the brief presentation and sort of amateurish review of the Parkside PKLL 10B3 crossline laser uh, tool so thanks a ton for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye bye